Damn, a while ago, I had a conversation with some chick. She was PMing me about something. It, damn, it was like it was like fuck half a year ago. I don't even have the messages anymore. But when she was talking about like, you know, evidence for God and shit, and I wasn't mad or anything. But one of the things she brought up was like healers and stuff. Like people, you know, you hear like a story in Africa, some lady healed somebody or some shit. Just these like stories you hear. I I don't believe any of those fucking stories. Or if they there's a logical explanation, I'm not even I'm not even close to convinced when it comes to this shit. Basically, my response. I, I, it really made me. It really made me think of just something new. My response to her was just, "Who gives a shit?" You know, like, like, I, I, like. Let's play a game. Like, let's assume every healer who ever existed was really a healer. Y- you know, even miracles, like miracles, healers, people. You know, just have these these powers or whatever, and they can actually do the shit they do. So let's start off with healers. I mean, how many stories of healing do you hear a year? Like, maybe five at the most of some, like, magical here you just happen to hear or you read somewhere? Like, who cares? Like, even if it did work, that's only, like, five people. You know, or let's say it was 100 people a year. That's only 100 people. They've only cured 100 people? I got some, I got. I know a method that's way better. It's called science. Think of all the people get saved from science every year. Millions. Actually, in a sense, billions because you and I wouldn't have clean water, clean, you know, food, everything if it wasn't for science. So who cares? Like, even if healers existed, who gives a fuck? Their method sucks. Their method only works on a couple people a year. I mean, science, not only does it cure millions of people a year, fuck billions, right? It fucking, you can learn it. You can learn how to do it. Everybody can learn it. Healers? Well, you gotta be like some mystic fucking thing, or you gotta read a, some spell book, or you gotta be part of some lineage, or some shit like that. It's not even universally accepted. So, even if this shit was real, which it fucking isn't, who cares? It's fucking pointless. It's fucking pathetic. It's dated shit. Alright, let's move on to miracles. You know, you can hear a story like, 10,000 people died, but a baby lived. Oh, how cute. In an earthquake, you know. Uh, why why didn't God save them all? I mean, wouldn't that be a miracle if there was a huge, crazy, psychotic earthquake? Ah, and no one died? That would be a fucking... That, uh, me, I would be I would be speechless, right? Um, so the baby lives. Okay. Who's going to feed the baby? You know, the baby's there by himself. Oh, wait. Science come in and save the day once again, right? Okay, let's say those 10,000 people survived and 100,000 people died or whatever. We've seen that before. Um, okay, so they live. They live the magical earthquake. Oh, it's a miracle. Yay. Um, who's going to save them? Their whole entire town is fucking destroyed. Uh, you know, once again, science come in. Science can also predict when an earthquake can come. Miracles can't do that. They can just fucking save little babies. All right, let's go to the miracles of Jesus. First one, he turned water into wine. Who ge- who cares? Like, <laughs> what? For a fucking stupid party, he turned water into wine? Great. You know what science can fucking do? It can make fucking millions of bottles of wine every fucking year. We can split the atom. He can turn water into wine? Who cares? And just like his other miracles through his life, like he, he cured a blind man. It's like... Who cares? We, we can take eyes on, you know, and replace them with new ones. You know, it takes a little bit longer, but everybody can, you know, we everybody can learn that. Only Jesus could do that, right? His other, you know, curing the leper or whatever. Well, we've pretty much extinct leprosy. Um, just common common things like the common cold, the flu, and all these things. We, we've completely defeated these things. Just these common, you know, these things would kill people in Jesus' day. You know, and Jesus only did this to a couple people. We do this to millions, millions of people every year. And here we go, finally, to his greatest miracle, right, is rising from the dead. Well, I mean, firstly, we have a superior society where we don't kill people because they say they're the son of God, usually we just laugh or think they're crazy. You know, so in that regard, we're, we have a superior society. Uh, well, I mean, that's that's a whole another video. But anyway, so he's he's up there, he's in pain. Well, we have morphine. We have, uh, we have painkillers. Who's to say Jesus didn't perform a miracle on himself and took away the pain, right? And then his whole point of rising from the dead. Well, we have brought people back from the dead multiple times. I can only imagine how many times a year, let alone maybe just a day, um, you know, with defibrillators, whatever they do to do that. Um, Thirdly, Jesus would have probably died, like, you know, not even at at the most 10 years after that, just how, you know, their society, once again, had, you know, just shittiness. 
And then finally, him rising the dead, you know, rising from the dead three days later. Well, there's actually a story where a guy did actually do that, but maybe it was just falsely diagnosed. Whatever. Okay, so we can't do that last part. Okay, so we can do every other fucking miracle ever and times it by a billion, but we can't do that last part with the three days. Oh, sorry. Okay, you got us, right? <laughs> Who cares? Once again, you can rise again in three days? Why wait three days? Like I said, we can defibrillate you in a second. Why wait fucking three days? You'll be dead, right? But okay, we can't do the three days part. We can triple your lifespan three times that, so, you know, no, we can't. But given the way the world's going... Given the way how science is just constantly progressing every year, every day, the next 50 years are going to be even greater than the last 50 years. It's crazy. We can avoid the whole three-day part. We can avoid the whole dying part probably one day. Don't you think? The way the world's going? Miracles, kids. Who gives a shit? Some Mary opens an eye, which was obviously done by some priest to get some people to go to his church. Who cares? You open an eye... <sighs> We can open the fucking sky. We can go to the fucking moon. Who cares? Miracles are fucking lame compared to science. So why do people get so ooey by this? I get, I get, I get the giggles when my TV turns on. How does that work? Fucking magnets, man. How do they work, right? <laughs> I don't know, kids. Healers, miracles, all this shit. Who cares? Fuck, the video you're watching is all more impressive than that, and all that shit combined. Not because of me, just the technology. All right, XXR23, ha ba 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 see ya. Yeah, Mr. White. Yes, yeah, science.